San Diego County has hit a huge milestone this week. 75% of eligible population now is fully vaccinated against COVID-19. The state is also making progress, but there is still work to do to address those still hesitant. Our ABC 10 News reporter Mimi Alcala shares the story of a local family's loss and their plea to the public. We have uh, broken now 80% of all eligible Californians having received at least one dose. And in San Diego County, 75% of the eligible population is now fully vaccinated. Governor Gavin Newsom announcing Tuesday that California has seen a steady increase in vaccinations recently. As of this week, we're 44% higher in our vaccine uh, doses being administered than we were the week after the 4th of July. But the work doesn't end here. There's still a large population hesitant about getting a shot. For my mother, myself, my brother, and my sister, we were vaccinated. My dad really was against it. He was like, no, it's 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 a conspiracy thing and the government. And I, I just I tried pleading with my dad, like, Dad, please, like, I just need you to trust the process. Brothers Alex and Ruben Huerta know firsthand what it's like to lose a loved one to COVID-19. Their 58-year-old dad, Ruben Huerta, recently died after being in the ICU for a month at Sharp Memorial. The doctors and the nurses that were just there for us, like, they really wanted a miracle to happen for my dad. They describe him as a hardworking man who was always there for his family. And my dad was the type of person who just left an impact on people by making them feel loved. He was just such a loving person that anyone that he came in contact with. Our whole family just took an amazing trip to Yellowstone and we had the best time of our lives. And while they're now going through the hardest time of their lives, they hope their story will encourage others to consider getting vaccinated. My hope is that more people see this and are just touched by the story to see a dad that loved his kids and his life being taken away. So if there's a solution out there, it, it's just get vaccinated, stay healthy, stay safe. Mimi Alcala, ABC 10 News. And so very young. Feeling for that family tonight. A GoFundMe page was set up for the Huerta family to help with funeral expenses and bills. We have that link on our website at 10news.com. Just click on the story on the homepage.